My name is Puspender Sani once again I came with a very interesting video tutorial. In this tutorial I am going to tell you how you can implement the delegate your custom delegate in iOS with Swift programming language. So understand this video and, and also I will tell you the uses and where you can use what are the use cases and how to implement that in your Swift 5 programming language. So understand and begin with the programming. So from here I am starting to create a delegate. So before that I will create a fresh project. Here I will select iOS because I am creating this tutorial for the Swift 5 programming language with the help of storyboard. Click on next. Here give the uh, name of your project whatever you would like to give. So here I will give delegate example. Okay. So after that click on next. Select the location and create the project while I am implementing that then you can understand how we can take these protocols in a use in our real-time application development so basically I have one view controller and I will open the main storyboard also so this is my main storyboard okay with the have uh, means uh, with one uh, controller we cannot explain the delegate and how we can implement the delegate so i will create one new controller i am creating just a dummy controller okay i will create one view controller file also The file will be type of UI view controller and I will give the name dummy click on next then the new file will be inside your project now open main storyboard again and you have created this view controller so I will assign the dummy view controller I will copy and the storyboard also dummy view controller now what is the next step here I will take one button and one label I will set the constraint so I have view controller with the label and button after click on this button I will open this view controller from this view controller I will pass one message which we will display on this controller so here in that way we are going to use the protocol so first of all I will give the outlets in my view controller file of button and label so here I can say LB description and same for button button I will say button ACT or we can say action okay now I will open my uh, view controller here I will set the action to my button okay so first of all I will create at obj c private function on tap of button here I can say controller self dot storyboard dot instantiate controller with identifier as dummy view controller and if you remember our identifier also was with dummy view controller so i will copy and paste now self dot present here i will pass the controller and animation yes true now this is my controller way which is i'm opening after click on button now i need to set did set inside that self dot button dot add action sorry add target target will be self selector will be has selector and here my on tap of button dot touch up inside touch up inside so this will be the action which I am which I have set now I will run and I will see the output first before integrating the delegate 
now the application has been loaded and i will click on open button so my another view controller is opening so after there i will give one button so after click on that button i have to pass some message and i need to display over here so now i will go back to my main storyboard in main storyboard i will go to the dummy view controller and dummy view controller i will take another button this button i will give the constraint to center or i can say 20 from top that's it and center in horizontal now i have this button on this view controller now i am going to say the title of this button that is click me after that i will take the outlet of this button in my view controller so that i can implement the functionality of clickable now just i will drag and drop click me after that i will open my dummy view controller i will drag little bit here now i will set the function to this also at objc private function on tap of click me so this will be my function here i will set the action did set in swift you are uh, in swift programming language we have two variation to implement the action on the button okay directly you can take as a outlet of ib action or you can implement like that i used to follow this self dot button click me dot add target self and the selector will be has on tap of click and touch up inside same this now after that i will print something now let's see what happen i will click open and click me here something print yes so it's printing whatever we have print normally what happen if i need to pass the data from view controller to dummy view controller that we can do easily okay so i will take one public variable in dummy view controller and from view controller i will set the data now the task is we have to pass some data from dummy view controller to ui uh, our view controller so how we can do that then the protocol comes into the picture to implement this type of functionality and make it very easy to implement so now i will create one protocol i will give the protocol name that is dummy delegate inside that i will create one abstract method okay here fun on tap click me now this is the method now i will call this method here first of all i will take one variable i can say where and i will give the name delegate what type of delegate it is dummy delegate and the default value will be nil now delegate dot on tap click me let's see let's run oh nothing is happening because we did not implement any linking in between delegate and in between our view controller so now this time we are going to implement the linking so how we are going to do controller dot delegate this is type of dummy delegate if you will see here it's a dummy delegate now i will give self that's it after that one last task extension type of extension will be view controller and what i am going to extend dummy delegate now here if you click on this then it will say add the protocol of dummy delegate no. now i am going to add the protocol of delegate so here it is print hi okay 
now again i will run and i will show you so here you can see something came and print high came now the thing is that the actual thing what we need to do i need to pass some string okay so i will take message type of string okay that i will pass here message that message i would like to pass okay to my previous view controller now and here one more line i am going to write self dot dismiss and animate true that's it now after that here it will give me the error message if you did not so here you can see so i will implement that protocol now you can see the uh, this is our old method and this is our new method so i will delete this now we are getting the message so i will set self dot lb dash dot text equals message now i can see the output click on run right now there is nothing is coming okay here you can see it's just a label and here you can see if i click open then my new controller will come if i click on click me then wow here you can see i have been clicked from the dummy view control so that is the use of the protocol and that's completely depend upon your requirement where it is required for you but i will i will give you one small suggestion in that whenever you are creating the protocol give your controller first name and then give the delegate so it will be easy to understand so thank you for watching this video i hope you enjoyed if you have any doubt any query related to the delegate you can comment into the comment box and if i am not able to explain something which i missed please also mention it to the comment box so that i can also understand that thank you so much have a great time bye bye